Hello everybody and welcome to Rainbow Six Extraction. Uh, we're gonna do a little bit different for this video. Uh, I'm gonna first show off, you know, the normal gameplay that I usually do, uh, my kind of editing style and everything. Uh, and then we're gonna jump into uh, a review. I kind of want to give you guys my opinion on this game, if I think you should buy it and what or not. Uh, but I'm not gonna take up much of your time. Here's the gameplay. Ooh. It looks like someone who just finished playing rank over on the right side. <laughs> oh, I can run the 417 on Doc. Oh. Wait, does Doc have ACOG here? He, he does. doesn't. <laughs> Hello, Mama. Hello, gamers. Uh, oh my god, you can quickly. Oh! <laughs> Bowl only! Oh, jeez. <gasps> That's old lion scan! Yeah. Dude, I could run around and melee this dude all day long. Sledge, where are you? Alright, get him out of there! I'm pulling! <laughs> oh, there's more goo! Oh, it goes even further in. Oh my god. You won, baby! Ah! Can you get rid of the balls on me? You need to get rid of the balls? Yeah, I have balls on me. Oh, you have to shoot. Thank you. You're coming with me, mon ami! Oh my god, look at this map! Hey, easy! That seems like a lot of XP. Like, that's a very high number. So Sledge is now injured. Uh, yeah, enjoy that. Or I'm gonna hammer one of these uh, bad boys. Where? Oh, Jesus! Oh, the claymores are five uh, lasers. I have four health. Let's go. <laughs> Look at the little hazmat suits. They got smoke. Parasite must have dragged them oh! Stay sharp. Oh, that's cool. You actually ping it for us. What, really? Yes! Oh, that is cool. And very OP if it was in the normal siege. Head over there! Let's go, team! <laughs> Why are you prone? I'm protecting you. <laughs> Oh that sound. It's like yellow. Uh, yeah, 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 I got you, I got you. Oh, they, oh you still have more balls! <laughs> you have more balls. But... Yeah, oh, more balls, gotcha! <laughs> Stand still! <laughs> it's so weird, I can, I can soft breach and then reinforce it. Hey. God, look at what I have. I have Maestro's LMG. On Alibi? Mm-hmm. Okay, that's not okay. That is yeah, not okay. All right, I'm gonna drone it up, fam. Oh yeah, we, we gotta sneak in on this one. Yeah. There it is. Take it out with your react blade. You wanna hear, you wanna know something that's even more broken? Vigil's right. invisible. <laughs> I'm gonna keep the beacon here. <laughs> That's, all right, all right. All right, well, as soon as the door's open, get ready. Some Archies seem to be communicating with an elite. <laughs> oh my they god, you look so dumb. Dude. <laughs> will be oh, with the, the Alda too. <laughs> get wrecked, nerd. Oh, I'm stabbing in, in the... <laughs> okay. Wait, did you run over and punch? Yes. Dude. <laughs> a shotgun. Oh! Hey, little grunt. Come here. Yeah, you wanna get me, don't you? Yeah, yeah, come here. Come here, man. Take it 
Oh. Oh, okay. Hey. Come here, little shit. Wait, can you prone? Ow! Stand still. No, go down. Uh, down there again. Ow! <laughs> Wait. <laughs> oh, you have balls above you. Did you miss all the balls? Yep. <laughs> it's an elite lurker. Oh, the claimers did half his health. Oh, and you just melted him with the FO12. Good night, sir. Very elite, lol. Oh, this is so broke. It's giving you guys wall hacks. It's weird how this goo grows. Let's go. Specimen. Fisherman. Hello, everybody. Uh, I'm gonna be quick to the point. Uh, it's almost 4 a.m. I'm trying to get this video done. I'm working with kind of a tight schedule, but I figured I wanted to sort of take this post video segment and sort of talk a little bit about the game and I might ramble a little bit I'm, I'm not gonna put too much effort into actually editing this part but I figured you know giving my thoughts basically I'm gonna give you my review on this game for starters I don't like extraction maybe you noticed when I was playing earlier this game had me engaged not at all Never did I feel like there was any intense moments or exciting moments, any climax really. You compare that back to, you know, the, the very event that uh, this entire game is based upon, Outbreak. Some of you might have actually played it, some of you might not have. Um, but that actually had some very intense moments where, you know, similar to the old Left 4 Dead moments where you would sort of alert the horde and you would have to fight them for... For a bit and it could become quite intense when you were doing it Th that never happened here um somehow extraction manages to be a worse outbreak it manages to be a worse left for dead or worse killing floor whatever you really want to compare it to it, it doesn't really succeed in anything there there are some elements that ties into sort of progression uh, but we obviously didn't get to experience them here but that might help keep you engaged a little bit i also want to mention that we did get to play on the ecs difficulty uh when we asked to switch up uh, everyone in our lobby wanted to switch up uh, we couldn't that wasn't a, a setting that we had available for us but this was the easiest game mode out of four so that might difficulty might make this a lot more engaging but still I have a, a, a hard time sort of seeing how this game would keep me engaged uh, and I feel like there's just there's already better games on the market I mean hell even <laughs> my own game last for well kind of manages to be uh, a lot more engaging than this um, uh, not sponsored you also have the upcoming game back for blood which is I mean pretty much a direct competitor to this Seeing as that game is essentially a Left 4 Dead spiritual successor, which this game is also kind of trying to be, but it just it just falls so flat. I I'm sorry. Like I know that a lot of people are genuinely excited for Extraction. I honestly do not think that this product is good. I think the very core game design that they have here. It's just not interesting. It, it just ends up being this whole thing like you're walking around. There's barely any enemies first and f foremost. Again, that might come with difficulty. Who knows? Uh, but like, I mean, there's like one zombie in one room and he'll be one shotted. It doesn't. You don't even have to run suppressors because the others are not really going to react to you an anyways. And there's like just a few enemies on each map. Apparently, the objectives are supposed to ramp up in difficulty as you go. That difficulty just seemed to already 
only increase the numbers of enemies slightly. And of course, you know, we're, we're kind of god gamers. I mean, I had Saronic and Kacha in my squad. So we didn't have that much difficulty. But but even then, I mean, it's it's a really hard time for me seeing how how this is going to stay interesting for more than one game. There are other maps, of course, that plays into it a little bit. But even comparing back to like Outbreak, uh, Outbreak was more engaging, more difficult, and it had more maps than what I, I got to play here. And even, like, I'm going to be completely honest, I wasn't a fan of Outbreak myself. Um, for me, like, that got boring really quickly too, but at least that I could, you know, write off because it was a limited time mode. It was only available for a few weeks in Rainbow Six Siege. This is supposed to be an entire game, and in my opinion, it's sadly worse than a limited time game mode that we had in original Siege. That's not a good thing. And I'm, I'm genuinely, I'm, I'm kind of baffled because this game has, you know, quarantine got announced years ago. And it's weird to me that they've gone back and reiterated on everything and, and they're still just so far away from something that would actually like keep people engaged and interested in actually playing this. But at the same time, like if you're still after, you know, you've seen the gameplay here running on screen, if you're still excited about this, I mean, go ahead, I'm not gonna stop you. You know, it's a, it's a single player slash co-op game. The game's not gonna die because you can't find people to play with. So, you know, <laughs> all power to you. Um, I will say, there's one mechanic that I, I, I really think is quite cool, and that's the whole like blinding spores thing, where they get stuck to you or your friends and you have to shoot it off. Like that, I don't know, maybe that could become like its own siege gadget. I think that's kind of a cool mechanic, but I mean, besides that, I, I don't really see too much of value in this game. But then again, I mean, there's still quite a few months until release, most likely. As far as I know, the release day hasn't been announced yet, so I'm... Um, yeah, I mean, who knows, maybe it gets delayed more. In my opinion, it should. From someone who does do work in terms of game design, this is just in my opinion, kind of awful. There's just so many lacking elements to actually consider this an engaging game that gets, you know, dopamines go brrr. And yeah, I, I'm not really gonna hold you for much longer. I've already probably hold you for long enough. If you actually watched all this way, I mean, I genuinely thank you. You know, I, I know I don't actually do opinionated content that much um i think it's important to do that in a case like this you know maybe i could help a few of you maybe save a few dollars or or, or something definitely do not pre-order this it's it's kind of a bummer i did hope for me that extraction was at least going to be able to bring some sort of like revitalizing essence to to the rainbow six community but i just don't think this is it sadly but we'll have to see again there's still many things that, that will be coming to Extraction that I have yet to experience with it. But at the moment, I do have a uh, very hard time seeing how they could actually make this engaging. But yeah, I'm gonna stop here. I've been rambling about this and probably repeating myself for way too many times. So I'm gonna sign off here. Thank you so much for watching. Um, subscribe for more content. I mean, I'm probably gonna make at least one Extraction video when the game actually comes out. Maybe. We'll see. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'm off.